I lead the research and development team here at Eversight. We provide research tissue, we discover new technology related to corneal transplantation. So we can study how different eye conditions are affecting the eye. We are finding ways to constantly improve corneal transplantation. We can take a tissue that potentially maybe wasn't a good fit for surgery and we can still honor that donation by saying this tissue is still a gift and it can still be used to increase the knowledge, whether it's for a surgeon to learn how to do a transplant or whether a researcher is trying to cure a disease. Everything that we do is with the goal of helping cure and prevent blindness. I love working in R&D because I'm on the cutting edge of knowledge. I'm the first to know if a drug is working or if a device is safe. We seek to solve or collaborate on solutions to untreated or undertreated diseases. Sometimes that means it's a brand new product for an untreated disease, or maybe it means that we're coming at an old problem with a new method. If I can do something that helps somebody's quality of life, even just a little bit, then I think I am sort of paying it forward. And for me, it's also very fulfilling too. I mean, saying I did something that could give somebody their life back, their quality of life, their independence, I think for me, that's worthwhile. The only constant thing in life is change and that change comes through research. We have put a lot of resources developing our research and development services. We have cutting edge technology. We have top of the top talent here. The techniques that we use now for our patients were a research project 10, 15 years ago. That's what I love about my job and the role that research and development team plays here. The things that we are working on right now are going to be in clinic in the next 10, 15 years. Here at Eversight, we are partnering with researchers and helping them push the boundaries of science. This is meaningful to me because we are offering a service to researchers that they previously didn't have. We're saving them a lot of time. We're offering them tissues that they didn't think they could get in such a timely manner, prepared how they want it to their standards, their specifications. Corneal transplantation solves about 10% of blinding eye diseases. So what we're doing is we're trying to find new solutions in terms of surgical procedure, in terms of drug development, and trying to come up with new technology to reduce the blindness. We work with researchers, so a lot of the times the researchers will have a big idea and they don't necessarily have the access to the tissues or they may not have the skill sets that we do. So we basically say, okay, we can take your project, take your idea. We will help you figure out what kind of donors best suit your projects. If you need tissue processed in a certain way, we are the facilitators of that. We also serve researchers globally and help them access the tissues they need so they can continue their research and their studies. At Eversight, We've always focused very heavily on the gift of donation, so that means that we are very specific about how we recover the tissue. Our focus is honoring that gift, and that means that our focus on tissue quality is above and beyond. People should care about Eversight because we're doing pretty noble work of taking somebody's gift, making it into an agent that's going to transform lives for blind people. They should also care about Eversight because we're part of this technology and innovation that's going to make these resources available for everybody globally. Something that's incurable today will be cured in 10 years and we'll be right there in the mix with the data on those methods. We are not afraid to try new things. We're not afraid to work with researchers who are doing the unexpected. We keep on trying and keep on developing new techniques. Even if what we do helps one person, then I'd say that's a job well done.